Hi, this is John Bon Jovi with the story of the Philadelphia Soul. Who will be the last man standing? This is what you call a lockdown shoe. See the name? See the number? Well, we've got a uh, number of guys on the uh, on the bubble, and, and and it's a chance for them to get on the uh, the actual playing surface uh, with the walls up and the nets, and, and and compete a little bit. And at the end of the day, we'll evaluate the tape and make some tough decisions. I think Coach said it best. There's however many guys in camp, and they have to get down to a certain amount, 26. Um, and for a guy who hasn't been on the Philadelphia Soul yet, it's you know it, you do a team. It's a team effort, but at the same time, it's for individual performance. And we need to prove we can go out here and come out with some chemistry and play together. Right. And until we right. prove that, that's what Philadelphia Soul is about. And that's what we need to strive for is teamwork and getting to play with one another each and every down. Right. That's what it's about. Right. Go, teamwork, baby. Teamwork on three. One, two, three. Teamwork! It's big. Uh, butterflies are already churning. Anxiety's there. We feel we're the team to beat. And... It starts tonight, you know, go out there and dominate them, you know, all four quarters and just let them know and let people around the league know that we're a team to beat. Yes, sir! Ball, ball. Attaboy. Coach, let's go, uh, let's go Jet, if you would, please, Jet. Good, good, Tony, good, Tony. Good, good. Good work, guys. Hey, great focus. I'm going to say that right there. Great focus out of this group right here, man. Great focus. A couple little things we're going to work on. You guys did a hell of a job. Let's keep it up now. Let's come out of the locker room and let's come out. Hey, come out ready. Okay? Come out ready. If you're watching this, Jay Gruden, we saving him for you. <laughs> It's been a great camp, and it's showing out there, all right? We really look smooth and focused. Keep it up, all right? Let's go have a good second half now. Let's go. That's it, Chris. Good. Good throw. I think I did good. I did good until I hurt my neck a little bit. Mom, I'm sorry I didn't tell you on the phone, but uh, didn't get scored on. That's the, the main main part. Good work. We had some good things happen tonight. Good things. Good things. But we all know we're out there to win everything, right? And we put ourselves in a bad situation. All right? Right? We can't afford to do that. All right? Let's get that cleaned up. Good job, though. Let's go. Get a break. It's for real from now on. All right, now? Together on three. One, two, three. Together. together. Today is definitely one of the sadder days. You can't keep everybody, you know, so. But it is it's very, it's a sad day, like a morning type day for the all around the league. It, it's a day or two that you dread as a head coach. In fact, some of them don't even like to do it. They, they push it off on their assistants. It, it's, it's not uh, a good day. Scotty, what's up, man? What's up, man? You doing all right? Yep. We're going to have to let you go. Okay. A um, couple reasons, mainly, um, we just don't have the room. Ryan, uh, it's just one of those things, roster numbers. Uh, I think you're a hell of a person, a hell of a football player. At the end of the day, uh, 
we just decided to go with these other couple guys. Hey, Larry, come on in, man. I'm gonna have to let you go, Larry. Um, I, I, I tell you what. To be honest with you, I mean, you're you're a great, great guy. You're a guy that I want to be around, but I don't know. It's it's not easy, Larry, because like I said, you're you're a great guy. You're a guy I went around. Uh, I apologize, uh, but at the same time. Um, anything I could do for you. I, I don't think you're ready right this second, okay? What I'm going to try to do, if you're interested, is try to, and no guarantees right now, but make a practice squad spot for you and keep you around. Would you be interested in doing that? One thing, I, I, just, I just start praying while he was talking to me. And uh, he said, well, we're going to keep you. And I was like, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> and I was just, I'm just excited right now. So I'm just glad I don't have a heart attack. Anthony, he, he can come off as, you know, he's very sarcastic. He's never serious. <laughs> so, I mean, he's, he's one of my best friends. He's, he's uh, always, just always positive, good guy. You know, he looks after me, um, just just happy. Uh, if you ever heard him laugh, very contagious laugh. You know? so, Our fists are shaved, baby. No zoom in on that. Zoom in on the shaved armpits, though. <laughs> See, the real powerhouses of the team are the guys that are a lot skinnier. You look at Matt Dorazio, Tony Graziani. Those guys, if you actually see them with their shirts off, it's incredible. One, two, no, not ready. Not ready. Not ready. Not ready. Warm up. Warm up. Warm up. Warm up. A little tight, a little tight. <laughs> <laughs> Only got hundreds. I need 150. 200. It's not enough. Try to get by. You get trapped. No. You get trapped. <laughs> and don't. <laughs> Hi, this is Brett Mutsey, coach of the Philadelphia Soul. Check out ESPN's Arena League show on Friday, February 29th at 7.30 Eastern on ESPN2. It's going to be a great season. One, two, three, go! Yeah. Yeah.